Hey guys, welcome back to another video with Lim Reviews. So in today's video, we'll be checking out the Studio Ad or ETT if you want uh, that has been released for the past six months. So definitely I'm not the first one here, but Studio was kind enough to send over these uh, ANC earphones to me. And I'm very pleased to actually say that it is a quite pleasant experience after using it for the past two weeks. So before I start off, I just want to show you the other colors that this uh, earphones comes in. And uh, we do have the version in white. Uh, very nice, a uh, clean color here with the white. Obviously, if you want a pure black, you can also go with the uh, fully black, matte black kind of look. Very sleek here, stealthy looking. And last but not least, it also comes with this uh, black and gold version. All right, I think there is also a pink, but uh, I don't have that in today's video. But the version that I went with at the end of the day is actually this in army green. And that's because I just love this color. And you can actually see it right here. I have the uh, earphones already in my hands. And yeah, like I said, I've been using this for the past two weeks and I just want to share with you my not so technical review of the Studio Ad. All right, so first up, uh, let me just talk about how it feels like in my hand. Uh, it doesn't, it isn't too big and isn't too small. It feels perfectly fine in my hand here. Apart from that, we also have this uh, nice leather pull tab here, which you can use it to hook this uh, earbud somewhere if you want to do that. Very nice quality here. Apart from that, we also have this uh, standard flap here at the top, but unfortunately, it doesn't close by itself. Like uh, It doesn't have a very springy feel to it like some other earbuds, but it's still fairly easy to open and close here with the Studio Ad. All right, so build quality overall, uh, it does feel like a nicely built device here. We have four LEDs at the bottom here to actually tell the amount of battery remaining in this device right here, and it charges up via Type-C. All right, so let's take a look at the earbuds themselves. Uh, let me just take this off. All right, so as you can see here, uh, we have these buttons here, physical buttons on the Studio Ad. And how it works is very easy. You just long press it to activate the ANC, and you can long press it again to deactivate the ANC. Obviously, you can also skip tracks, uh, play, pause, uh, go to the previous song, all with that button. And I actually find it easier than just um, tapping on the other earbuds because uh, this actually gives you a physical feel to it. Uh, the good news here is that the button is very soft to press, so you don't have to like push right into your ears, and it's very easy to activate. All right, apart from that, uh, let's talk about how the audio sounds like about this uh, from this studio ad. Obviously, uh, I can't let you hear the sound coming up from this, but I'm pleased to report that the bass coming up from these uh, earphones right here is actually pretty strong. Uh, if you're like me, you like to listen to some uh, uh, chill hop, uh, this kind of uh, sounds with a little bit of bass. I would say that the bass is actually very nice uh, on these earphones right here. Uh, if you hear normal songs, uh, country songs, and the standard songs, it also sounds pretty good. It's de it definitely doesn't sound like those kind of cheap earphones that you would buy for about 100 bucks. So yeah, definitely feeling uh, some, kind of, some kind of quality there in terms of the audio. Apart from that, I'm also pleased to announce that uh, I've been taking a couple of calls on this device right here. And the person on the other side of the phone was actually able to hear me fairly clearly. Uh, so can I on this earphone. So this is actually pretty good if you are the kind of person who makes a lot of calls on a daily. So you can use it to listen to music and can also use it to answer your calls. All right, uh, last but not least, let's talk about the comfort factor of this earbud. So let me show you what came in the box. We do have a lot of ear tips here uh, for all the kinds of sizes. As you can see here, it comes in an XS, SML, plenty of sizes. So if your ears are tiny or you have a huge ears, um, don't worry, uh, one of these earbuds will actually fit you perfectly fine. All right, so in terms of actual comfort when I use these uh, earbuds, to me, it actually feels pretty good. Uh, let me just try and put one in so you can see how it looks like. It looks like that. All right, so it fits perfectly into my ear. I'm using the uh, M size uh, ear earbuds, I think. And uh, it actually feels very comfortable and I can't hear the sound around at all. So very nice. Uh, and of course, if I activate the uh, deactivate the ANC, uh, obviously I'll be able to hear some noise from the surrounding environment. So uh, fits perfectly, doesn't look too uh, huge, doesn't stick out too much. Uh, I'm not sure if you can see it clearly, but this is how it looks like on your ear. Okay, I think that's pretty much it for this device. Um, this is about 600 plus ringgit here in Malaysia. Uh, obviously the pricing will differ based on where you're at, but for Black Friday, I think it's going to be sold at about 510 ringgit. So definitely if this is uh, within your budget, this might be, uh, the Studio Ad might be something you might want to consider when looking for your next uh, wireless ANC earbuds. All right guys, I think that's it for uh, this simple quick review. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to let me know down in the comment section below. Uh, hit that like button if you feel like hitting it and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.